So I just, one of my biggest interests is fossils. I just really, it's so interesting how these things are millions of years old. Dinosaurs were around before humans were even thought of. It's incredible. Yeah, the, uh, the Earth is actually only 7,000 years old to the day. I mean, how else would we be where we are with all this technology? I mean, come on, we need the dinosaurs to have helped us. Hunting as cranes, alarm clocks. That's, you know, that's not how that works. Scientists have known how old the Earth is for hundreds of years now. There are many people who believe that the Earth can only be 6,000 years old. The textbooks in our schools are filled with the idea of millions and billions of years. The next time you hear someone say millions and millions of years ago, stop them and ask, were you there? But the science behind dating the Earth can be explained with a bang. It turns out that the science behind the atomic bomb is the same science that went into dating the Earth. I know it seems like a weird correlation, but let me explain. In order to make an atomic bomb, you need a substance that is exceedingly rare, uranium-235. Uranium-235 naturally occurs on Earth as a small percentage of all available uranium. The vast majority is made up of uranium-238. This can be traced back to the difference in decay rates between the two isotopes. Uranium-238 has a half-life of around 4.5 billion years, while uranium-235 only has a half-life of around 700 million years. In order to make an atomic bomb, scientists had to separate the uranium-235 from the uranium-238. So they used a whole myriad of different methods on doing so. It doesn't really matter, it's pretty complicated. And you're still wondering how this relates to dating the Earth. It all begins with a magic mineral known as zircon. When a pool of magma cools, it can create tiny crystals known as zircons. Uranium can get trapped in these zircons, and based on the amount of uranium-235 compared to the amount of lead-207, scientists can work out a date for when that zircon formed. This ratio between uranium-235 and lead-207 has been an important tool for geoscientists to understand the age of rocks, and in turn, the age of our planet. If you believe in a bomb, you really can't believe the Earth is 6,000 years old. Now don't you understand why we know the Earth is so old? Yeah. 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 Um. Can I get a check? Check.